Hey y'all, so today I thought I wanted to do a review on the new Michael Jackson Escape CD album. I got it yesterday and of course I listened to it many, many, many times. And I have to say, this is like really good because and I'm not just saying that because I'm an MJ fan, okay? Like seriously, every song on this album could have been on like the charts, the Billboard music charts. Um, and I say that because the music, the lyrics, a lot of the stuff was done in the 90s and a lot of it was done in the 80s. No, actually, maybe one song was done in the 80s, which is Love Never Felt So Good. That was done in the Thriller era. The rest were done in the 90s in the early 2000s and um my favorite song on here i have two actually of course one is love never felt so good because it's so catchy and so michael-ish but my second favorite song on here would be a place with no name to me that song is very uh, esoteric and spiritual and it's just how he feels when he's with um, it, it, you just have to listen to it. Okay. It's basically, um, how he feels when he goes off, you know, to this magical, um, spiritual place where everything is great. And, um, it's called a place with no name. So y'all check it out. Um, of course. And then at the end of the song, he has to tie in like a woman to it to um, actually make the song universal because a lot of people aren't on that level yet. Um, so uh, lots of musicians do that. They make a song that's really like esoteric and spiritual and then they have to find a way to add um, something in it to r relate all people. So he kind of uh, says that the woman is his key to get to this place which is also esoteric but it also opens up more of a uh genre for people to like the song and have it mean something else to them but to me it means something else uh, <laughs> so and i've that song has been out for years um uh, like right after he left in 2009 they that song was playing all over youtube the unmastered version of it as many of these songs um the songs that have been out for years that I've already heard is Place With No Name, Slave to the Rhythm, um, Do You Know Where Your Children Are, Blue Gangsta, and Escape has been out for years. Um, these are just the remastered cuts of it. If you're like a true MJ fan like me, you've heard all like 90% of these songs already on YouTube. Um, the, the three that hadn't been leaked was Love. Well, Love Never Felt So Good. It, it, I think it's been floating around too. Chicago and loving you um, and the reason I think Jeep gave um, put the song on their commercial is because in the song a place with no name he, he speaks uh, he sings about riding his Jeep <laughs> so he kind of gave them a shout out so they kind of used his his song to sell the album because it's like publicity on both ends you know they sell Michael Michael sells them so okay win-win but um, I think I've already done the CD, I mean the video on this CD, so y'all know what's inside of it. But I haven't watched the documentary yet because I haven't had time, but I will watch it. It's probably um, the making of this. So um, there's lots of like snippets on YouTube already that I've watched, which is probably going to be on here like that. But just to see the whole thing in its entirety will probably be... Um, really good and nice so if y'all have um, got this album and y'all have any um, thing to add to my review or your opinions about it let me know what is your favorite song on this album and now you know um, they're playing that MJ Jeep commercial in heavy rotation like every time I walk in my living room the TV's on I hear it love that felt so good and I'm like, mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, well, that's my review. I hope you liked it. Um, and 
I will see y'all next time. All right.